Vintage Audition AM Solid State Pocket Radio. This first appeared in a box of non-working or troubled, not working correctly, uh, pocket radios, vintage transistor radios, a viewer sent me. And there was a lot of discussion because Audition was Woolworths or Woolco's, Woolco house brand and I remember we had a Woolworths and I remember going there it was in the Delamo Fashion Mall in Torrance when I was very young before it went out of business and it was kind of a messy cheap import dime store type of thing although they were a little bigger than that and I actually dug up something I remember buying at Woolworths and I was a very young kid when I bought this and these were on display on the checkout counter and some of you will remember this of course this is a 45 record so anyway I still have this and yeah I bought this at Woolworths in the Delamo Fashion Mall it was located across from Radio Shack uh, in the same area as Montgomery Wards and near Bullocks. And there were a couple music stores in there back when things were cool. Anyway, um, it has a problem. Let's hook it up and see what the problem is. I have not powered it up yet. Very nice. It looks like it comes with a micro schematic in the back. Two IF stages and it looks like it's these are germanium these are this is all germanium so this could be fairly old 60s anyway this should be a moderate performer so this is milliamps and I do have a current limiting light bulb now on my lithium batteries. So here we go. Where's the... Ooh, this is a headphone lover special. Let me crank this up all the way. Okay, this is an easy one. This is a AVC filter capacitor. God, I was so caught up in the sweet sounds that I didn't even look at the amount of current draw. So it idles at about 8 milliamps, 7.5, say 7. And. While my center. So like 22 milliamps. Okay, first thing is spray the uh, volume control. Okay, so scratchy. What we do is we just spritz it right in here. Oh, that was good. Just, just flood it, just juice it on up. Okay, so like I said, uh, the squealing is usually due to an AVC filter capacitor, the little feedback capacitor. And I wonder if maybe this is 1970. Let me see if I can find that capacitor on here. Okay, so this is the AVC filter capacitor right here. Let's 
see that one right there this is the feedback line right here the volume control feeds back and what this does is it basically takes the positive or negative or whichever way the voltage goes when the signal gets hot the voltage changes and this counteracts the gain so it, it like automatically turns the gain down and when that capacitor goes open it just turns into a big feedback oscillator loop I absolutely love a schematic with no values on it I mean what is even the point of this I guess the point is what I just did with it um, okay so we have one two three four electrolytics these two are most likely just uh, voltage filtering this is probably the AVC right here and this is probably the volume control coupling low volume this one would be open uh, poor base response yeah whatever you want to say about that one of these and then this is probably the one that's bad so let me check this and watch it make a fool out of me okay I'm about to terminate the virginity of the radio here that's it it's been popped okay that one I said I thought was it is completely open nothing okay the bigger one here is measuring about what 8 ohms ESR which is acceptable for this the other big one is measuring uh, four and a half ohms these are the ones that I said would cause bad bass response wouldn't want to have bad bass response on that big ass speaker and the volume control coupling capacitor is measuring seven ohms which is not gonna replacing it wouldn't affect the performance one bit so just the AVC filter is open here's a little two microfarad capacitor and what we're gonna do these are non-polarized so it's they make nice test bridge capacitors because you don't have to worry about putting it in backwards we're just gonna bridge that capacitor and see if it helps anointing of the sick uh, to, to those who needed it and so eventually Stu became a very humble man he had lost everything and he just lived that So there you go. So all we need to do is change the one capacitor, then we can listen to our whatever. I think what I'm going to do just to be ridiculous is take one of these little surface mount tantalums off. 335, that's 3.3 microfarads. Um, I'm going to take one of these off and put it on there. Just put it right on the bottom and leave the original in place. If it shorts, it no big deal okay the chip capacitor has been installed of course on tantalum the line marks positive on electrolytic the line usually marks negative those are yes. out of this world berries yes it Oh, yes. Scheduled execution in Texas next week has 
many from both sides of the aisle calling for a halt to it. The case involves Melissa Lucio, convicted in the murder of her two-year-old daughter. Ellen Kreitzberg is director of Walk Around the College. The Sixteen City. One many missteps in this case, including corner. ones by detectives that led to the Okay, so right above KNX, KNX is 1070, which is really strong. Right above it is 1090, which is a sports station out of Tijuana. And then right above that is the old Radio Disney. Uh, and the Soviet radios will, if they're working right, they will pick up those three stations separately to where you don't have crosstalk. I don't think this will do it. Hours before she died, her lawyers say Lucio was especially vulnerable when she was all of our she was in the post quarter brought to you by my computer career training for a better life. You're going to see it on Sports Center tonight. I urge you to find it. Concierge onboarding process that I got. Just go to unchained.com slash concierge. It's, it's I think this free. is the. KEIB, the Rush Rush Station, which is pretty strong, 11-something. Um, so there's four stations in there, and this is picking up two of them. You know, I sure don't like the look of where the world is heading right now. Do you? The Ukraine-Russian war, gas going up, oil going up, fertilizer going up, wheat going up, in fact, all food going up. I already have my IRA with Noble Gold, so I'm safe. That's got to be KEIB. It's like walking into an official sports betting partner with the NBA. 120, 121, Stanford, get The folks at Hollywood Suits are one of the nation's largest... Yeah, so this is getting KNX, then... Uh, it's skipping over 1090, then it's getting, uh, it's skipping over the little weak Hispanic station, then it's getting KEIB. So, uh, very bad selectivity. For five of them, the driver successfully moved the... Why does, why does that matter, what I said about the stations? Well, if it'll pick those up, then you know it, if it'll pick up, if it'll separate those stations, then you know it's a good DXer. This is not. Stop searching for that one of a kind car, truck, or SUV, hybrid, or EV, and start driving at the Irvine. So what I want to do. Twelve of the top domestic, import, luxury, and exotic brands. Turn your search only at Auto. Prozone.com. More often. to the NBA tonight post-game show powered by 5-Hour Energy. Try and... And that's our getting it. And the color print will last through certain shades with Southern California's most accurate and dependable forecast. I'm CBS 2 meteorologist Alex for to find out more. Not sure if he addressed it when he spoke with Cassidy Hubbard, but again, that steal by Austin Rivers, Nicole Jokic called it. Here's Joker with Cassidy. Nicole, that was a gritty physical win. I don't need to tell your eye that or your arm for that matter. How do you sum up this fight with your back's against the wall? I mean, they're just a team, you know. Uh, we needed to put up the fight. We didn't want to get slapped. Uh, I think we didn't deserve it to get slapped. So, uh, we just pride in ourselves and uh, we, were, we were fighting you know they're, they're a great team but they won. What did you see on that team? Merchants according to him and so um probably me Monday and what is this? the kitchen. Elaine from Burbank echoed that sentiment. It's all like a picture of building a little doghouse, I think. And it's just like, yes, time for that. We're here till 10 p.m. Eastern time. Look at the Jeopardy for 30. Sunday night baseball coming up as well. Just having fight. How much fight do you guys have? Uh, I mean, from the left. Can I Okay, there's 1090. 
What I'm doing is I'm nulling K and X. If I null K and X, because the antenna is that direction, the K and X antenna. So if I put this at the null and K and X doesn't overpower 1090, then it comes in. So, like I said, probably a mediocre performer. So anyway, that's the quick repair of the Audition 1970, I guess. 1970 Audition Solid State AM Radio. I do like their logo. I think that's kind of cool. A uh, mediocre performer. But hey, we did it without affecting the original look and removing the high sonic branded capacitor.